Come on, Ida. I'm ready to go. Hold on, baby. I need to let everyone know that we on a Valentine's Day vacation. Besides, you need to tell your grandkids we gone be gone too. Ah, uh, they already know. Now let's go before it gets cold. Robert, it's February in case you forgot, and it won't get hot till another month and seven days and you know that. Why, thank you, Captain Obvious. Excuse me? I love you, Ida Robinson. Okay, I thought I would have to go down the no-sex zone lane. Hey, 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 Huey. Ida and I are gonna be gone for the whole Valentine's Day. But Valentine's Day is not till tomorrow. Boy, I know that. So why are you telling me this? Cause we're gonna be gone. And I better not come back and hear you guys acting up and throwing some kind of black sucking fiesta in this house. Because if so I'm gonna ground you ground you ground you for two weeks. Okay granddad we won't pull nothing. Okay, I'm just warning you. Ha happy. Valentine's Day. Ooh. What do you want from me, Riley? Well, I wanted to say... And if it's anything stupid and irrelevant, I'm gonna throw you the hell out the damn window. You better say something nice, Riley. You don't wanna get Uncle Phil get through the window. Ha 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 ha. Well, what is it? Granddad, why yo shorts so short? You know something? I don't think I'd have gone be concentrating where y'all going on y'all trip. Yo penis might fly out and brush somebody on the arm, or they leg. Or they ass. Why is everybody looking at me? Here comes the pain. A wash up in Marlin. What's up, Riley? Y'all got a minute? Now you straight come in. I mean, what's up? You're not looking good for some reason. Yeah, I know. It's my girl Beatrice. What's she pregnant? Nah, Negro. She ain't pregnant. Today's Valentine's Day, and I ain't got her no gifts. Damn. What you need my help? Yeah. Man, I'm broke right now. I ain't got no job. I'm back living with my moms. Man, this Valentine's Day is hell. Wait, don't you still got the job in the office at the market? The supervisor fired me. Yeah, I don't have that back office no more. Wanna found out and she told the supervisor. That bitch. I know, that's exactly why nobody couldn't stand her in high school. She's such a tattletale. Look, we just go to the clothes place and look around and see what's perfect for her. Go look around? Yay, come on Marlon, it's only 10.30. Alright, let's go. You think this might be good for her? Yep. Marlin, she's gonna love you for that. Let's just see. Ready to pay, sir. Wanna? Oh, hi Marlin. Riley. Wait, 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 wait. Since when do you work here? You didn't know we work here. We've been working here for the past 18 months. We can't believe this is my first time seeing you visit. Wanna? You never told me you work here. So what about your job at the market? We have those jobs. We work at the market full time. We work here part time. So, are you ready to pay? Listen. Ma'am, right now I'm broke at the moment. So, may I hear how much will I have to purchase on this when I purchase it? Well, it is Valentine's Day. This looks really pretty. I think your girlfriend might love it. So the price you would have to pay for this is 24.50. Excuse me? You would have to pay 24.50. Cesaro de Gathro do say Gaunta? You have to pay 24.50. Ha 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 
How do you know what's she saying? Cause I know Spanish. I knew Spanish since I was two. Look, I still don't have any money. Listen, I got a plan. You might have to go back to your crib because I don't want you part of this and bring Huey with you. What the hell am I doing here? You're gonna help us with Marlin's present. And don't worry, G. We got the paper. Oh boy. Aight y'all, ready to do this? Fosho, let's do this. Okay. Huh. Nothing. Come on, let's go. What? Pay for the gift. Oh, okay. Okay, wanna? I mean, ma'am? I'd like to purchase this pajama set. Okay. Your total is 28 dollars and 75 centavos. Marlin, she just played us. She said the pajama set was 24.50. She didn't play as she added tax. How much paper you got on you? $25. Damn it, Marlin, that's not enough. I know, all I need is $3.75 more. Well, I don't have $3.75. Yo, Huey. You got $3.75. Hey, I'm occupied here. I'm broke. $28.75, please. Okay, look here, woman. You tricked us, and you lied to us. You told us the pajama set was $24.50. Now we pay for it, you say it's $28.75. I demand you change this price, or I'ma tell your boss that you're trying to rip us off. Okay, you na piedra, sir, you can't demand me to do anything, you work here you don't, and thus, I am the boss, I'm the captain, I'm the war chief. Now it told you once and I'm gonna tell you again, the price for the pajama set is 28 dollars and 75 centavos. Well how come you didn't tell us that when we first asked you? You have to purchase it with tax. What if we don't want to pay for the tax? Then you cannot purchase the item. That's a bunch of BS. Well, that's too bad. Either pay for the total or leave. Fine. We'll pay. Marlon? Hand me the money. Good looking out. Here you go, senora. Sir, this is 25 dollars. Do you have 3 dollars and 75 centavos? No, we do not. That's all we have. Marlon? Huey? I got the pajama set. Let's get out of here. Sir, get back here. You did not pay for everything. Listen, woman. We paid for the damn thing. Now we're leaving your store. Now have a nice day. Sir, I am not about to play this stupid game with you. You did not pay the full price. Yes, I did. You told me it was twenty-four fifty, and I paid that. Ma'am, I apologize for the situation. Look, we'll just make you an IOU. Is that okay? No Marlon damn and I owe you. We paid. We're out of here. Riley you're causing us in here man. Now you need to chill. And we're given one of this I owe you. Fine. Let's give her an I owe you. Okay. Wanna? I Marlon and Riley. I'm not putting in here cause he was no help. I Marlon and Riley owe you three dollars and seventy five cents. Cash and three quarters. Okay. Now we give the AOU to Wana and she'll understand. Okay? And I think we're too late, Marlin. Why you say that? Because the security guard is right behind us. And I'm going back to the crib. You're not going anywhere, punk. Punk? No, no, homeboy, I'm not a punk. I'm from Chicago. I'm from the ghetto. My mom's pops and granddad didn't raise no punk. Yay, yeah, yay. Yeah. Come with me, tough kid. Sir, you have to understand, we didn't do nothing wrong. All we did was try to purchase a pajama set, and we didn't have enough for the tax, so we wrote an IOU and that was it. No, 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 I don't have to understand. I need to understand. Wait, need to? Yeah, need to. I need to understand that what you guys did was wrong and unacceptable, and when your parents hear about this, you three are going to be in serious trouble. Hold on, Mr. Chief. Why am I in trouble? I wasn't part of this. I was talking to my girlfriend for Valentine's Day. Well, you walked in with them, so you're pretty much in trouble too. Okay, thanks a lot, Marlin. Riley, I'm never forgiving you for this. Man, Huey, you always gotta be the good guy. That's what's wrong with you. You can never be cool and bad. 
you always gotta be smart and innocent. Well he's a genius, he minded his own business the whole time, while you two were not following the rules about purchasing an item. Sir actually I'll let you go. But listen to me for a quick moment, if you come to this store and pull what these two barnacle heads did, you're gonna get consequences. Do you understand? Yes sir. You're dismissed. Whoa 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 Huey, I know you're not gonna leave me in here. I won't Riley. Later. No! Oh, 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 Huey, come back here and save your baby bro. Uh, hey. Boy, I hate having a big bro. Huey, when I get out, I'm so gonna. Sir, sit the hell down and behave yourself. It's your fault for doing what you were doing. Come on, chief, I'll do anything. I'll stay out of the store for 6-9 months or for a whole year. Just let me out of here. I will let you out. Soon as a parent come and get you. You know what? You can tell my parents to come pick me up. My parents are out of town anyway. So you can go ahead and call them. Because they're not gonna pick up either. Silence. Shut your mouth right now. Marlin? Ma. Glad you're here. Don't you dare explain a word to me you thief. But mama I have to explain. I told you to shut up. Now I don't want to hear any explanations. Hello sir, are you the manager? I'm the chief. Hello chief. Odom. Chief Odom. Chief Odom, what's my son in for? Stealing. What did he try to steal? Pajama set for women. You tried to steal women's pajamas? I didn't know it was a women pajama set. Marlon Brown I swear when we get home you are in so much trouble. Riley what are you doing here? I was with your son Miss Brown. So you both were stealing? Ma'am listen, the reason these two were taken in is because they tried to purchase this pajama set, but they didn't have enough to pay for the tax, so instead they paid $25 and not the rest of the $3.75. I can't believe you guys would do such a thing. Mama we tried to leave and I owe you but they wouldn't take it. What I owe you? This I owe you. I Marlin and Riley. Owe you three dollars and seventy-five cents cash and three quarters. Stupid IOUs. I mean what year is it? 1976? I don't know they act like the past is today. You know something? How about I just pay for it? It's okay ma'am, you don't have to pay for it, okay? Just do me a big favor and go home and talk to your son and do something to his homeboy there. But one thing I need for you to know, next time these two pull something like this again, the plotter on police department will hear about this. Now have a nice Valentine's Day. It was nice meeting you. It was nice meeting you too, Chief Odom. You have a nice day also. Thank you. Oh, and the $25 they paid for the pajama set with, make sure they get it back. Will do. Let's go, you negotiating multi-time act and bully. <coughs> what are you waiting for, Riley? You might as well go with me. Come on. You mean I don't have to wait for my granddad? No, but you're still gonna be in trouble. Now come on. Okay. Thank you so much for not calling my granddad cause if he heard about this he'd be all over me. So you going inside clothes places stealing clothes for women like a thief? Mom you don't understand. He wasn't trying to steal it Miss Brown. Oh yeah. Well, what was he doing? We went inside the store to buy the pajama set. We thought the price would have been $25, but instead it was $28.75, so we tried to leave an IOU for the tax, but the security guards was behind us. Okay. I'd like to ask one more question. Marlin? Who is this pajama set for? It's for a girl. For a girl, huh? Who's the girl? Is it a girlfriend? No, it's just for a girl. It's for a friend of Marlin's you know. She's a girl and she's gonna receive a friendly present from Marlin, due to him being friendly. You know what I think you guys are just talking? I don't think all of this is true. This is all just words y'all using so no one won't have to get in trouble. Marlin? You're grounded. What? Two weeks, upstairs to your room right now. Ah uh, mom this is ridiculous. That's too bad, and you go home. Marlin's not to have any company when he's grounded. 
Whoa! Huey, what are you doing here? Marlin's in trouble, huh? His mom grounded him. Damn, man look little kid, I'm sorry I left you in there. Not don't even mention it, gee? Granddad doesn't know, Chief didn't even call him. He didn't? No. So what you trying to do? Look I had a plan. What's that? We just go and buy the pajama set for Marlin. And how we supposed to get the money? We go and take it out of his mama's purse. Oh no oh 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 oh. Oh yes s s s s s. Oh no, that's stealing. Yes it's stealing, but we're getting it to buy a present for Marlin's girlfriend and his mom has the money, you know what I mean? Shoo if that's what you think then okay. Okay, so who's gone go get it? Well she told me to go home so it's not gone be me. Okay I'll get it, I'll be back. Got it. Marlon? We have a present for your girlfriend. She gonna lose it. What present? There's no president, there's no Valentine's Day. Marlon, of course there's Valentine's Day. It's today. Whether you have a Valentine or not, it's still that day. Well, where's the present? It's right. Riley, where's the gifts? Boom! Bang! Oh, y'all bought the pajama set. That's right. Man, y'all the best. See, now that you got it, you can go to your girl's house and give it to her. Now that you have a gift for her. Yay. So where the money come from? Um. Huh. The money. What money did y'all use to pay for this? You know, Huey, it's kinda getting late. What time is it? It is 5 after 3. Yay, we should be getting ready for our Valentine's dates. Come on, let's do that. Yay. Pull up? I mean, I recall a skin a question. Uh, Mama? What? I feel bad for what I did. You should be, you could've went to jail. I know, but I was just trying to buy a Valentine's gifts. You never told me who's it really for. I was trying to get this pajama set. For you. Happy Valentine's Day, and happy birthday. Ah, uh, Marlin. I love it. Well, I wanted to get my mama something for her birthday and Valentine's Day. Marlin, I love this so much. I see. Well, I'ma go back upstairs and continue my punishment. Marlin, wait. Yeah? Was this really for me? Yeah. So you mean my baby boy was trying to buy me a pajama set for my birthday and for Valentine's Day? Yes. How did you manage to buy this? I didn't get it. Huey and Riley got it. I'm just giving it to you. How did they pay for it? That's what I'm asking. Do me a favor and pass me my purse. Here you go. No, they didn't. You mean? Yep. They did it, Marlin. Those thieves. They stole the money out of your purse. Don't worry about it, Marlin. I got something for him. You run grounded. Really? Yeah. I don't know what I was thinking of grounding you, cause there's two other boys who gone be grounded. Huey and Riley? Yep. Come here and give me some love. Mama? Yes, Marlin? I'm suffocating. Rock to the rhythm, you don't stop.